will solve today class 1 IMO that is Bath Olympia 2023 set a question paper. So let's solve and find the answer key for same. First section is logical reasoning. Question 1. Select the odd one out. Now here A sun, B is moon, C is star and D is a bulb. So odd one out is D bulb because that is man made item. Rest all are natural. Question 2. Find the missing number in the given number pattern. So let's see the pattern. First is 1 and the second diamond is 5. That is 1 plus 4 equal to 5. Then third one is 9. So 5 plus 4 equal to 9. So in each diamond we are adding plus 4. Let's follow the same pattern. 9 plus 4 equal to 13. So here missing number is 13. Let's complete the pattern to understand whether we are right or wrong. Plus 4 is 17. 17 plus 4 is 21. So we are absolutely right. Our answer is option B 13. Question 3. Ruhi visited the garden on 4th Sunday of November 20xx. On which day did she visit the garden? So we have to find the 4th Sunday from this calendar. Let's see. First one is this. Second is 12th. Third is 19th. And fourth is 26th November. So we got our answer. Answer is option D. 26 November. Question 4. Which of the following shapes looks like a cuboid? It's very visible. It's option B. This looks like a cuboid. Question 5. Frog dash is third from the right end in the given pattern. Where is the right end? Okay, we found it. Now we have to find the third frog. First, second, third. M is the third frog from the right end. Option B is the right answer. Question 6. Dash groups of four blueberries each can be formed from the given blueberries. So we have to make groups in which there are four blueberries. Let's start making the group. One is this and second is this. So we got only two groups of four blueberries. Answer is option A, two. Question 7. There are dash people standing on the railway platform. Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. Option B, 5 is the right answer. Question 8. Which of the following is the heaviest? That means having the highest weight. The very heavy one. And it's very clear that it is option C, loin. Question 9. Select a figure from the options which will complete the given figure pattern. Let's first see the pattern. We have AB, then CD, and then there is missing 2, and then GH. So, how will it complete? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. So, here it should be E, F. The right option is option A. Question 10. There is a certain relationship between the pair of figures on the either side of analogy. Identify the relationship of the given pair and find the missing figure. So there is bicycle and two tires. Then there is car. Then how many tires should be there? It should be four, right? Car has four wheels. Option B is the right answer. Let's move to the mathematical reasoning. Question 11. There are dash months between the fifth and the ninth month of a year. How many months are there in between? Okay, so fifth is there already. We have sixth, seventh, eighth, and then comes ninth. So in total, we have three months in between fifth and ninth. So option D is the right answer. Question 12. Add the numbers on the given abacuses. Okay, let's find the numbers. So the first abacus is 43. And the second abacus shows 35. Now we have to add these. 43 plus 35 is equal to 78. Option B, 78 is the right answer. Question 13. Which of the following is the thinnest? The thin one. Okay. And that is our option B, pencil. Question 14. Which of the following is arranged in descending order? Descending order means going from largest to smallest. Let's see A. A has 76, 72, but then it is 27. 
and then 67. So it is not correct descending order. Then B is 72, 76. Okay, so here itself it goes wrong because the highest one is 76. It should be first in the descending order. Moving to C, 27, 67. Again, this is not correct. D, 76, 72, 67 and 27. And this is the right descending order. Option D is the right answer. Question 15. The total cost of the given items is, so there is one bracelet which costs rupees 58, then hairband that costs rupees 30. Let's add it. So 58 plus 30 is equal to 88. The right answer is option C, 88. Question 16. How many more strawberries should be crossed to show the given subtraction sentence? And what is that sentence? It is 12 minus 5. So 5 should be crossed. Right now, how many are crossed? Only 3. So we will cross 2 more. Okay. And our right answer is option A, 2. Question 17. There are dashed triangles in the given figure. So let's count the triangles. 1, 2, 3 and 4. In total, 4. Option C, 4 is the right answer. Question 18. The number name of the number written on the elephant is? It is 78. Option D is the right answer. Question 19. The length of the given magic band is how many clips? Okay, let's see. It is between this and this. How many clips are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, in total, 5 clips. Option B5 is the right answer. Question 20. The given number line shows what? Okay. So, the number line first, it is going to 2. And from 2, there is a jump of 4 more. Okay. So, it is showing 4 more than 2. Option D is the right answer. Everyday Mathematics. Question 21. Kanek bought 58 balloons for her brother's birthday party. If she uses only 35 balloons, then how many balloons is she left with? Okay, here we have to find the difference. And whenever we have to find the difference, we do subtraction. So, we will do the subtraction. 58 minus 35 is equal to 23 balloons. Option C, 23 is the right answer. Question 22. Mohit bought the given items from the market. How many of these items look like a cube? So, dice is a cube. Water bottle is kind of a cylinder. And then gift box is also a cube. Then ice cream is a cone. And the last one is a sphere. So, we got two items that look like a cube. So, option B, 2 is the right answer. Question 23. If one box of chocolates costs rupees 55, then the cost of three such boxes of chocolates will be. So let's add 55 three times and we will get 165. Now let's see which option gives us 165. Option A will give us 100 plus 50 plus 10 plus 5. That is equal to 165. So we already got our answer. Still let's check other options. Option B will give you. 50 plus 20 plus 20 that is 90. C will give you 100 plus 20 plus 10 that is 130. And D will give you 100 plus 20 plus 10 plus 5 that is 135. Our answer is option A. Question 24. Priya threw a stone on the mango tree and some mangoes fell down as shown. How many total mangoes fell down? So we have to simply count it. 1, 2, 3 and 4. Right answer is option B, 4. Question 25. Kirti has a bag which weighs 5 kg and Shruti has a bag whose weight is 2 kg more than Kirti's bags. Find the weight of Shruti's bag. Very simple. Shruti's bag would be 2 kg plus 5 kg. That is 7 kg. Right answer is option C, 7 kg. Question 26. Aman has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 kites and Manju has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 kites. How many kites do they have together? All together. We have to add it. 9 plus 7 is equal to 16. Option B, 16 is the right answer. Question 27. Select then correct statement. A. Shape of chalk piece is mostly cylinder. Correct. Go and observe it. B. Birthday party caps are cone shaped. That is also right. 
see a door is mostly rectangular in shape this is also correct a window is always a square now this is incorrect statement because it can be rectangular also it can be square also it's not mandatory that it will be always a square question 28 in a garage 42 cars were repaired in the first week okay then 35 cars were repaired in the second week okay how many total cars were repaired in both the weeks so they are talking about the total of these two 42 Plus thirty-five is equal to seventy-seven. Right answer is option B. Question twenty-nine. Virat has eighteen toys in his toy chest. He gave five toys to his sister. There are dash toys left with him. So we have to find what is remaining. So we have to do the subtraction. Eighteen minus five is equal to thirteen. Option A is the right answer. Question thirty. Sumit got a cricket team jersey for a match in his locality. Which of the following is the number name of his jersey number? It is eighty-three. Option B. Now let's move to the achievers section. Question thirty-one. Select the correct option. A. Book can roll as well as slide. No, that is incorrect because it cannot roll. It can slide because it has a flat surface but not a rolling surface. B. Kind of a brick is a 3D shape. Absolutely correct. We got our correct option, but let's see C and D also. A rectangle has three sides. No, it has four sides. The shaded face in the figure is dash. Is a triangle. No, it's not a triangle. It's circle. So this is also incorrect. Or you can say it's oval. It is also incorrect. So option B is the only correct answer. Question 32. Arrange the following objects in descending order. according to their lengths and select the correct option okay descending order means the highest would be the first and at the end would be the lowest okay so let's see comb is 6 in length then candle is 5 in length and rope is 7 in length so which one is the highest 7 then come 6 then come 5 rope comb candle option c is the right answer question 33 ashish went for bhangra classes in september 20 xx if every tuesday and every sunday is a holiday then fill in the blanks the number of days ashish went for bhangra classes is so we if we subtract all the tuesdays and sundays number we'll get the working days right so let's do the subtraction the subtraction would be 30 because september is having 30 days minus 8 for tuesdays for sundays and we get 22 so a is 22 then b the number of holidays in the month is very clear you can count it 4 plus 4 8 okay so a as 22 and b as 8 is an option d question 34 match the following and select the correct option column a Seven tens plus three ones plus five ones, so seventy plus three plus five. What it is? It is seventy-eight. P matches two. Q is eight tens and nine ones. That is eighty plus nine, eighty-nine. Q matches three. Then five tens plus two ones plus three tens plus four ones. So it is fifty plus two plus thirty plus four. So it is equal to eighty-six. R matches one. So the right option is option C P two Q three R one. Question thirty five. Which of the following abacuses shows a number which is less than seventy five but more than sixty six? Okay, let's see abacuses. So A is giving us eighty five. Oh, it's not less than seventy five, so it is not correct answer. B will give us forty seven. Okay, so it is less than seventy five. But it is not more than sixty-six, so it is also not correct one. C is seventy-four. It is less than seventy-five, and it is more than sixty-six. I think we got our answer. But let's see D also. D is eighty-three. That is incorrect. So option C, seventy-four, is the right answer. With this, we have successfully solved class one IMO twenty twenty-three Cedric question paper. Do like the video and subscribe to the channel Kids Funzy Laugh and Learn. There are many more Olympiad papers, and also there are several 
playlist which have educational content go and browse the channel and stay tuned because we'll be uploading many more thank you happy learning bye bye